In this video, I'll show you how to change the default font in LibreOffice Calc. Hi, my name is Michael with Office Nifty. I make quick tips and video tutorials on how to use Calc software. So normally when I open up a new spreadsheet, Calc uses font of Liberation Sans at 10 point size. The easiest way to change it so that every time I type something new into my sheet is by going to styles in the menu and choose manage styles. This opens up the style sidebar and here it shows that default is selected. So the way this style works is I can easily change it. For example, I'll double click on good and we can see that I changed it to green text with a light green background. This is sort of a preset that comes with a style under the status. And same thing, I could choose heading one or make some very quick changes to various cells in my sheets. So back to default. The way to change it is right click on it and choose modify. Here opens up the cell style default dialog. And here I can just pick any font that I have. I'll scroll down and try to use Sego. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing that right. And I'll change the size to 11 and I'll choose OK. So now we do see the font is changed to Sego 11 point font size. Now if I type more text, it continues to use Sego UI because it's using the default style everywhere. I can still also change it by double clicking some other styles. But whenever I type in new text, it just uses the default and it uses what I've set. So I can save my file and then the next time I open it, it'll continue to have this behavior where the default font is set. Now if you're wondering, what if we want to set the default and have it used for every single new spreadsheet? So I just explained how to change it for one particular spreadsheet. In order to set it so it's always used for a new spreadsheet, we have to use a template. So the best way in creating a template is first to clear out anything that you don't want from the template. Here I'll just delete my cells and then I want to keep the font to be what I'm using. And we can access the templates by going to File in the menu, choose Templates, and then Save as Template. So the dialog opens up. I'll just give it a name. And then we have to choose a category. And now the save button is enabled for me to use. So if I just click save here, it will create as a template. But what happens is the next time I open up a new spreadsheet, it won't use it automatically. If I want to have it load automatically, I need to check set as default template. So I'll do that and choose save. Oh, this appears because I already created a template previously with this name and I'll just overwrite it. So now I'll test it out. I'll go to file and the choose new in spreadsheet. And now we see that it's using the font I had set previously. And the way to edit or remove the default template to something else is by going to file templates and choose manage templates. Here it shows my template that I created and there's a little check icon next to it. This means it is a default. Firstly, if we want to remove it as a default, we can so that way it doesn't always load this on a new spreadsheet. You can go to manage and choose reset default spreadsheet. After clicking that, the icon with the green check mark is gone and this is just a regular template and it won't be automatically loaded every time I open up a new spreadsheet. If I wanted to delete this template, I can right click on it and choose delete. So now that I deleted it and it's no longer the default, if I go and create a new spreadsheet, so now we're back to Liberation Sans at 10 point font. So that's it for today's quick tip. I went over how to set the default font for a specific spreadsheet and also how to save it as a default template to be used every time you create a new spreadsheet. I hope this video helped. If you have any questions or if there's something else you'd like to learn, feel free to mention it in the comments below.
Thank you for watching and as always, stay nifty.